one people, it's your boy Trox. I am the plug, this is Premier Battles. Welcome to Short Circuit. If you're in the building, make some fucking money. Yeah. Yeah.
Georgie. Floating like that. <laughs> 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 I'm too raw for the concussion. <laughs> really, crime sick of y'all. I came in for the dog, Tito. Pro, I'll put him in a rizzle lot. I'm in my oh, element. I'm in my element trying to crush, but this is more than familiar. You could get lifted or slumped. Which route you want, bro? The sativa or the indica? Oh! 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 I need paper if I'm smoking crow. And every time the camera on him, you can tell this is just a post for bro. You as fake as it gets. If I'm lying, I'm Pinocchio, but fuck waiting on my nose to grow. Bro, you a theatre kid at heart. And the way you act, it goes to show. I told Briggsy I give Mr. Hollywood a couple headshots. They trying to build his portfolio. <laughs> but you my homie though. You my homie though, so I was stressed out writing for this one for the whole time And in a way, I'm glad you get to die for glory Cause in this one, I take no pride <laughs> Fuck that, yeah, let's go Fuck that, let's go, keep going You my homie though So I've been stressed out writing for this one for the whole time And in a way, I'm glad you get to die for glory Cause in this one, I take no pride Nah, no, fuck that, he ain't actually my homie And I've got a few ways to take bro's life So, so far I've been so kind But now Dr. Jekyll gotta go hide So which one do you want, bro? The new blade or the old knife? Or I could put you between the two points as quick as possible And we'll see how the crow flies You can hear how rehearsed he is In every single line that crow's spitting And I know it's a pre-written format because it ain't supposed to feel so scripted. Look, I can hear who he's a fan of in every one of bro's lyrics, his jokes, gimmicks, and literally his whole spirit. It's like his ability for mimicry has no limits, and you're a graphic designer too, Crow. That's mad to me, because you couldn't even create yourself in your own image. And oh. 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 at first I found your name hard to flip, because I was stressing a lot. Then I realized I flipped Crow my whole life. That's why you get in a box. This one's to get in your loft. And I was stressing a lot. Then I realized I flipped crow my whole fucking life. That's why you get in a box. box. Nah, fuck that. I got another crowbar. This one's to get, get in your lot. Today I'm smoking caddy packs. Come, let's see if you really are the best of your crop. Time. <laughs>
It ain't hard to get it. And maybe he is stuck to the trap like peanut butter. But he's the baitest round, though. I could give a fuck if you're a drug dealer, because you ain't breaking down crow. So mm. yeah, so ease back, relax. I mean, you might really be where the fiend's at, but the one thing I know for sure is you ain't never dealt with no speed bags. <laughs> cause, cause that, That's crazy. Cause, Cause that boxing match you had was tragic. He threw a little jab and I'm like, what the fuck was that shit? <laughs> Yo, you know how when Clark Kent removes his glasses, he turns to Superman quick? Well, when Georgie takes his glasses off, he gets his ass kicked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You, sh you should have seen him. You should have seen him spinning around out of his head. He's like the total exact opposite of Schrodinger's cat. Because if you box this pussy, there ain't no doubt that he's dead. <laughs> You were levitating. He smacked you out your Nikes. And judging by your fashion since, you landed in the 90s. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, I mean, first you were Jamiroquai. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I mean, first you were Jamiroquai, and that looked fucking shit. But wait, now he shows up as Nick Lachey or fucking Justin Timberlake. <laughs> yo, yo, a fucking Justin Timberlake. But, and, and that's fine. But you've got a skinny, sunken face, and yeah, you'll only be someone's ugly tit today. Fuck that shit. All right. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, Yo, time, time, time. I need to apologize to Scoop, Prem, my whole team, cause forfeiting that battle really ended up hurting my pride. But I had to postpone and then pull out for bail dates and stalemate, and that shit ended up getting pushed further behind. So even though I'm here, I kind of feel like I ain't, cause I'm still concerned for serving some time, and then they gave me pro after I dodged the wing the whole summer. Bro, you ain't been the only bird on my mind. Bro, I was Let's go, let's go. Talk good talk. Talk good talk. And then they gave me crow after dodging a wing the whole summer. Bro, I'm sorry, but you ain't been the only bird on my mind. Still, I was on at Briggsy for a chance like this. I swear I'd almost driven him spare. I said, once all my shit's in a clear, I need to redeem myself. Any up, any place, give me a ring and I'm there. It's gonna take some kind of divine intervention to stop me from killing a brain. In fact, you know what pro need right now? Cause a wing and a prayer. Cause I know you got a couple decent names on your resume now. So all credit where it's due, you battle a couple vets. But I'm not sure your shit with Bolski, Pamphlet and Mackenzie Measures up to mine with Tony Shuff and Rex. I have even dismantled, I have even dismantled industry rappers that would have made your fucking voice break and your knuckles sweat. Pro, I have stood down things you haven't even had to stand in front of yet. So, oh, oh, yes. I have stood down things you haven't even had to stand in front of yet. So let's just forget any notion that this man is a rival. I was battling your idols before your actual rival. Just cause you got you nine up your ass and matter on your fucking verse tracker don't mean you can start acting entitled when I was crossing the waves when I was crossing the Atlantic on waves I made cause you was here battling Tidal and, <laughs> and I know you're gonna talk about me choking in America but do you really think that I'm rapping? Bro can't relate to trying to be great for three rounds on the same day you flew for nine hours. Mm -hmm. Your career performances are less views than half of my miles travelled. And that ain't even... Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. But do you really think that I'm rapping? You can't relate to trying to be great for three rounds on the same day you flew for nine hours. Your career performance is on less views than half of my miles travelled, and that ain't even an excuse, cuz. I just need you to know there's a difference in how I battle. Cuz you <laughs> A ladder against lazy. I was in the crowd thinking this prick is special. You know you can't run that shit with me, right? I know I ain't tall, but this kind of step up ain't just incremental. It's a big jump. Take the lift, cuz. Or crow will get broke down like I'm flinging pebble. No, fuck that. You really need an elevator around here, cuz. Me, I'm on a different level. No. Fuck that one as well, bro. I can give crow wings and you won't reach my heights at all. So elevate or not, pushing my buttons is only gonna highlight your flaws.
chill for a bit. But for now, I brought some crowbars with me. So we're about to get into some shit. Like how you went from low tier to battling the old tiers. But you lost and you lost and it's so clear that now the fans just don't care. Johnson and Johnson, the kid got washed and it never brought him up no tears. I mean, I mean, I mean, how you still not hold any weight? They gave him so many plates that his stomach is rupturing. They overfed him like that bloke in seven, but he's a glutton for punishment. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I remember when they used to say this dumb motherfucker was running things, and that is borderline offensive, like when Trump was in government. Then he said, then he said he went away to get his appetite back. Abandon the operation like a gastric bypass. Then they said he went away to get his appetite back. Abandon the operation like a gastric bypass. But before he left, he took parts from everybody. It was a massive life hack. Damn his rhyme pads like Frankenstein's lap. Even stole some, even stole some of my shit. Well, I can't advise that. So you better cut it in the future, like Samurai Jack. Or, or I'ma send you, or I'ma send you a fucking message to which you can't reply back, and you could get hacked to death like Caroline Flack. Oh, yeah. Then he did come back, and, and, and it, then he did come back, and it's still no show after no show, and lying in your personals. Bro, you fucked over people you called family, and that's the shit that hurts, that hurts the most. Like, the way you set up Tali in, in your class with him made me pack these rounds with gunpowder. Cause on that day, it was actually you who begged for it to be a one-rounder. Yeah, yeah, then blamed him. Yeah, then, then blamed him, and had the nerve to say he does bad business. What the fuck? That's twisted. That's why it's off with his head. So, bro, why should NLC ever call you again when they can't even call you a friend? But, yeah, but when they can't even call you, you a friend, but it's a blessing, because he goes from friend to foe in a second, acts like a bitch all the time, think Chris Brown or Tory Lanez, he can switch on a dime. Oh, 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 oh Two-Faced, two, yeah, Two-Faced, used to show his true face, but it got bored. Now we make up fake angles, that's contouring. It's, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we make up, yeah. now we make up. Now we make up fake angles, that's contouring. It's funny that you owe, you're indebted to the leagues for what he has, but always throws it back at him, like a rugby pass. There's a, there's a, there's a, there's a balance though. He's trying to pull up to that top spot, but thinks I ain't a challenge though. But you know that goes both ways. It's a palindrome. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yo, I to, oh my I to, days, I to, I keep, Cause I, I had to kill him for the gas. This is American terror. It's time to face your mistakes since you say you're the king of error versus error. Mm. Yeah. 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 Never. Yeah. Never. Yeah. Never. Yeah. Never. Yeah. Never. Yeah. But, but, but now that now they've been shown the proof and they know the truth, I'm out here exposing roots like a broken tooth. Bro, bro, I'll knock your fucking molars loose. So someone tell this, so someone tell this guy watch his mouth because I've got a crown that you won't remove. So, yeah, so, so fuck you, so fuck you and any agenda that you have. Yeah, fuck you. I didn't think that one would hit, so I appreciate it. So fuck, so fuck you and any agenda that you have. Trying to win battles by just saying anything you can. Now, don't get it fucked up, cause I ain't never anti-trans, but you're like Caitlyn Jenner before she changed her gender. Cause you used to be respected as a man. Yeah, so fuck, yeah, so fuck, so fuck you, Enigma, Tech, 
and Jester. I'll put you I'll put you all in the cast. Yeah, I'll put you all go. I'll put you all in the cast. Yeah, I'm mad extra. And when I catch him, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Tell him go. Yo, yo, so fuck you, Enigma, Tech, and Jester. Right. I'll put you all in the cast. Yeah, I'm mad extra. And when I catch a body, I just leave a black feather and a note that I wrote with it saying, You should rock He says it's about to be a murder. Murder, murder. Another fucking thing. How's it about to be a murder? You look like when you see blood, you faint. But fuck it, if it is that, bring the whole of ABK and Glory too. There ain't a single one of you that can move to bro. I guess it is about to be a murder. Cause I'ma kill this whole group of crows. This ABK lot fight back. This ABK lot are two buddy buddy, real fruity types. If it is that, you can bring the whole of glory in ABK too. There ain't a single one of you that can move to bro. I guess it is about to be a murder. Cause I'ma kill this whole group of crows. You ABK lot are too buddy buddy. Real fruity types, you know them rare breeds. Type to call themselves a tribe. Well, I see his bad chiefs. Bro, I was on your Facebook the other day. Well, I see his bad chiefs. I was on your Facebook the other day. I see all I needed to know about their team when I saw a picture of you fam. Playing guitar to you, man. And you're both outside in your bare feet. Fuck. <laughs> you ever been to your boy? Have you, have you, ever, been, hey, listen, you ever been to your boy's house and just peeled your socks off? Don't do that. You don't do that. You don't do that. Don't take your socks off. Shoot your car. Shoot your car. Don't take your socks off. In the garden. In the garden. In the garden. Types, you know them rare breeds, type to call themselves a tribe. All I see is bad cheese. Bro, I was on your Facebook the other day. And I see all I needed to know about their team. When I see a picture of you fam, playing guitar to you now, and you're both outside in your bare feet. You two were shot like two foot away. <laughs> I was sat like, you two need to put your fucking foot away. <laughs> Too close. Too close. Too close. Too close. Too close. Too close. <laughs> what have you done to the monstrosity? <laughs> Inhuman ball of rage that wrote raps with ease. Now he's getting acoustically serenaded while his toes catch a breeze. <laughs> what did you do to the monstrosity? Honestly, that was you, Crow, fucking Crow, who squawks in his intros. Like that's supposed, like that's supposed to give me a big fright. What you chose your name because it symbolizes death coming, yeah? Well, roots are known to give life. And sometimes, listen, you chose your name because it symbolized death, right? Well, roots are known to give life. And sometimes, the roles reverse, because we all got a little young that's in the yin, right? And you know what else is a sign of death coming today, Crow? This knife, bro! It could be a big knife or a flick knife. It'll still stick right in your inside. See a joke, man. But this one was made to split sides. Ooh. This one, this one will leave your chick with a couple scratches like a bitch fight. But this one. But this one was made to split sides And this one, this one will leave your chick with a couple scratches like a bitch fight But this one, this one will see your baby mum in the worst way It's a midwife Man, but this one was made to split sides, and this one, 
This one will leave your chick with a couple scratches like, like a, a bitch fight. Like this one, this one will see your baby mum in the worst way. It's, it's a, a big fight. fight. You can't fucking punch like me, bro. And what are you gonna say? I can't punch either, cause I got beat in boxing. Cool fam, I can let it slide. Cause in that ring I've had better fights, but in this ring, I am fucking Kimbo. And anyone can get a slice. I can't punch neither, cause I got beat in boxing. It's blessed fam, I can let it slide. Cause in that ring I've had better fights, but in this ring, in this ring, I am Kimbo. And anyone can get a slice. In this ring, compared to Kimbo, I'm fucking Bobby Rex's size. I'm like seven five, and I have terrorized every guy that's ever tried to step inside. Crow, beat me. Fuck it, that really ain't a smart bet. I'm about to, you're about to take your last breath, bro. I got my heart set, I got him sussed. But there's one thing I haven't asked yet. Patrick, how come you look so much like a school shooter? I ain't killed anyone in your class yet. <laughs> Yo, it's Caveman, we're at Short Circuit. It's been a crazy battle between Crow and George Roots. Uh, I gave it to Roots. Uh, I think the first round I gave to uh, Crow. I thought he had really good schemes. I thought George had really good schemes as well, but what Crow was doing was he was tying it back to the point a lot better. I give the second round to Georgie. I think Georgie, uh, they both had good rounds, but Crow finished a little weak and Georgie's was just really strong. Finished really, really strong on the elevator bar. And the last one, I'd say Crow had amazing bars, punch lines. George had great bars as well. So it was a really well matched uh, thing. And I'd say on punch line count, Crow might have got it. But for me, the whole uh, thing Georgie said about. Um, oh, what was his, his thing in the second round? In, in the last round. He had a really, really funny angle in the third round. Uh, I can't remember what it is right now, but you'll know because you just watched the battle. I saw that flung it to me in the end point. Safe. Oh, what a way to decide the entire season. These guys fought incredibly hard. To the classic 1-1 one, one going into the third. Georgie just picked him at the post in an incredibly close and hard to decide battle. Both guys fought really, really hard. But 2-1 Georgie Roots. Yo, Premier Battles. Just came off watching um, Crow and Georgie Roots. Fire battle, fire battle. Shout out to both of them. Um, difficult one to call, fuck. Difficult one to call, but I scored it 2-1 to Roots. Um, I had Roots taking the second and the third just because every time Crow got to a certain level, Georgie was building it up, building it up. And then when he got to where Crow is, ended it well. So I definitely score it as 2-1 as Georgie, but Crow, crazy. Shout out to both of them, man. South side or no side.